Republican. Now, Chief Justice Martha Koome has disowned claims by President William Ruto that the executive entered into a deal with the judiciary over the enactment and implementation of the Affordable Housing Act of 2024. CJ Kome says it is not possible for the two arms of government to engage in deliberations about a matter pending in court, saying it is possible that the president was misquoted. Kome's response comes hours after the High Court declined to issue conservatory orders suspending the new housing law setting 16th of May as the mentioned date. Seth Olale has more. Responding to the president for the first time over claims of an agreement with the judiciary in realization of the Affordable Housing Act, Chief Justice Martha Kome denied ever agreeing or cooperating with the executive on the issue. The Chief Justice sharply deferring with assertions made by President William Ruto on Saturday during a development tour of Bomet County. The judiciary is not in any capacity able to enter into any agreement with the executive, especially in a matter that is before court. The judiciary was not a party in that uh, course. Speaking in Naivasha while presiding over the official opening of the annual conference for judges of the Employment and Labor Relations Court, the Chief Justice said the president was either taken out of context or misinterpreted. Jumatatu, mimi naenda kuweka sahihi, sheria mpya, ambayo tumekubaliana na mahakama ya mambo ya housing. I am a judge, I'm not a communication expert. But what I could say or deduce from that conversation is that it was taken out of context or there was misinterpretation. Tumekubaliana na mahakama tuwe na sheria ambayo itapanga mambo ya housing. What I like to assure Kenyans is that the judiciary was not a party in that matter. The judiciary was discharging our function of determining a dispute which was before us we are independent, we are impartial, we were not parties to the case. CJ Kome's rejection of the claim, coming hours after the High Court declined to issue conservatory orders, suspending the new housing tax until the matter is mentioned and determined on 16th May 2024. That's Justice Checha Mwita ruled that the petition challenging the Affordable Housing Act raises fundamental questions and requires urgent hearing. He ordered that all pleadings be served to all parties immediately and that respondents and interested parties file their responses to the application within seven days after service. Even those people who get houses, they will not be allowed to sell until the board agrees with it. That in itself is a constitution. The framers of our constitution were very clear that even the courts have got limited jurisdiction when it came even to matters of bills of rights. Submissions are highlighted on the 16th May 2024. Seth Olale, Citizen TV.